we are opening up more Pokemon today. I've got one, two, three. Don't know if these are Pokemon cards. Looks like it could be. This one feels like it could be. I have a lot of stuff over here. I got these as well. Again, trying not to show these addresses. I've got these. They might be Pokemon cards. They might be bills. I don't know. But we're going to open it all. We'll start with these little packs first. These little... Oh. Start with these guys first. See if there's anything in these. Oh, you know what? <clears throat> I might have drank in a couple too many seltzers one night. Dude, look how these cards are just actually taped onto here. Okay, they're, <laughs> they're energy cards. Okay. Man, I was... Wow, that was actually very nice, the way that they did this. So these, we'll put trash on the chair. What did I even get? Oh, okay. I remember. I remember ordering this. It's like, I don't know how these guys can't be part of your favorite Pokemon. It's like two bucks. Two bucks for these guys. A little hollow. You definitely can't tell on this Apple laptop, but there's a hollow bleep down there too, which is nice. Um, what next? Go to this guy. Yo, imagine watching this and realizing that one of these is like an audit. Um, I have no idea what these are. Dude, I have no recollection of buying these. Two Team Rocket Ekans. Three Team Rocket? Who in their right mind would buy three Team Rocket Ekans? It's a cool card, though. That's a classic. I probably did buy all these. They were probably like 50 cents a piece. And when the booster packs are $500 a piece, I mean... What are you going to do? We got another one. Let's see what this guy is. <laughs> okay. So, in my little Bud Light Seltzer bender that I had, apparently, I was really in on Gengar. <laughs> Fun new game. Drink. And then order yourself Pokemon cards. Because then when you're sober, it's like a surprise. I didn't. I didn't personally buy those. That was a different version of me. Okay, what do we got in here? Guess who it is? I mean, look, it's a cool card. Is my car alarm going off? Um, I mean, so annoying. That's a cool card. I think these jumbo cards are underrated. If we had like an overrated, underrated thing, I will put these as underrated. I mean, it's in t not the best condition, but... If you get like a really good one of these, you could fr if you're really into Pokemon, you could frame it and have like a cool little cool little art piece. Right. Let me get a sip of just seltzer, just sparkling water. I was gonna say seltzer water. Dwight Schrute. Yeah, that's, that's what she said. We're gonna save. This 
big boy. I don't know if that kept loading. Um, we're going to save this big one for last. We're going to go to this one, which I got off um, Mercari, which is like a buying and selling app and website, whatever. Um, and I believe this one is from a seller called Brits Collectibles. So if you search that, it's uh, it was a mystery box. I'll tell you exactly how much I paid too. Let me log in on here. Um, so this one was seven bucks plus shipping. So I'm not expecting really anything like. I'm not expecting anything out of these mystery boxes. It was just something to open, you know. So first off, we get it in a little pack. Don't don't drop the pin. Don't drop the pin. This is one of my favorite pins, actually, is the Mimikyu one. One of the Pokemon, by the way, that like it would be cool if he existed or she existed. But you would definitely want this one on your side. Cause it's like it's you saying no to ice cream one more time and it's losing its mind. Now, I don't think there's going to be a card trick. Uh, so we're just going to go through these. Trainer. Ooh, okay. Okay, a little reverse hollow Nitto King action. We're going to see what our hits are in all these, and we're going to... Okay, I'm going to have to put the cards that are... I'm going to turn them face down and put the cards that are in the sleeves at the end because I simply can't hold on to them. Actually, we're just going to put these ones face down over to the side. That's what we're going to do. Um, actually, do you want me to just go through these and tell you if there's anything? Um, no, no. I feel like this, I feel like when they made this Pokemon, that they were just like running out of ideas. That they're like, what can we do? Uh, Oranguru. What is it? It's an orangutan. Um, again, I said it before, I don't know if I've said it on a video or if I've said it in real life to people, Onyx in the cartoons, amazing Pokemon, right? You want him on your squad. Even in the games, really, you want him on your squad. The card, this is the updated card. I wouldn't even say a reprint because it's, it's not a reprint. They upped his stats because it was so bad. I think it was the rock throw was like 10. Um, I've never seen this card, but I don't think it's really anything. Oh, it's from, uh, it looks like it's from like a deck. Um, we got a rare, a non hollow rare. Man, what all these cards? Oh, but wait, there's more. We got these two bad boys. What do we got here? We got a glaring mister. Oh, a little rainbow rare. Okay, look, dude, for seven bucks, the, this to me is worth seven bucks getting this. The rest is just bonus. Um. And I'm a big fan of any Nitto King card, so especially the uh, the old school. We're gonna go to this one because this one's just packed so nicely that I feel like it. No, I said we're doing that last. We're doing that last. Um, I don't remember if it was Gym Heroes or Gym Challenge, but there was a uh, Giovanni's Nitto King. That card. That card was a was a sweet card. This one is uh, this is the guy's name, so I don't know if I should say it or not. What are these? Ah, I remember what these are. 
another thing that I think could be underrated, whether or not like you buy and sell, um, which like with Pokemon right now, it, you kind of have to buy and sell a little bit, just because like your art, like your return on investment, you're paying. Ten, twelve dollars for a booster pack if you buy them online, and uh, it just like doesn't make much sense. And these, how much did I spend for these? Fourteen bucks, big hitters, right? Do you guys remember these? The Burger King promo cards. They're kind. I mean, they're kind of sick. We got a Mew. We got Mewtwo, Dragonite, Dratini. This dude had like a lot of them. Zapdos, Articuno, Snorlax. Sorry, I'll let it focus a little bit more. No. Okay, I mean, Flareon, Jolteon, a couple Tauros. We're just, I'm just going through to see if there's any other. Um, one of my favorite Pokemon, Hitmonlee, I feel like he gets a bad rap. We'll just go through these things. I mean, an upside down Pokeball. Really, really creative, guys. Krabby. Hypno. I mean, is there anything cooler than the original 151? If your favorite is not the original 151, that's probably why I bought it, apparently. Apparently that night, I was like, yo, give me all, give me all of the Gengars. I want all of the Gengars. So stupid. Uh... Onyx, Shiny Haunter, more Haunter. If you guys want any of these doubles, let me know. I'll send them to you. Do you remember the Grimer card where he was looking up the lady's skirt and it got banned? Banned, banned, banned. Geodude was an underrated Pokemon. A lot of these things. We're getting to the end though. We're almost there. Sixty okay. We're just gonna we're just gonna go through the way I was doing it because there's just too many of these things. I really just wanna see oh what a card. Look at that little Raichu. that Charizard. Who pulled the Charizard out of a mystery box? Hello? And a chameleonaire. Chamilitary man. Kid show. Forgot. It was a kid show. Had to be. Can't talk about chameleonaire. Don't go look up chameleonaire. Now this one. This is from a seller on Mercari. Bond Durant Poker Trading. What a freaking mouthful. Look, dude, if you if you go and watch this, just tag yourself in the video. I'm gonna let you know that I opened it up. I don't know how much this one was, but this video is going on too long, so I'm not gonna slow it down anymore. And I'm not going to pause it to go look it up because I am inconsiderate. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I was right. This is going to be the best one, I think. We have like, it looks like a legit tin. And it's got even the promo card in it. Now it's not a sealed tin. But, 
probably, probably terrible on your ears. Apologies. And I'm just going to say, all of these tins, let me, I should probably just see how much this guy's worth. Um, 10 bucks, 8 bucks or something. Alright. So we got our little promo card. What is this? Are these stickers? Did he hook us up with some stickers? I mean, they're kind of dope. Pikachu and then the Neo. I don't know, like, the regions. Okay. Get some McDonald's garbage that he didn't want. Dude, how, how much <laughs> is... Hold on one second. Let me arrange these. Trying not to look at anything. Um, didn't really look at anything. How much is this stuff? The stuff that you're like, I can't throw it out, but I really don't want it. Don't need it. That's what that is. Anyway, I appreciate you, brother. Um, if you're watching this. Okay, so we have some stuff in sleeves. I'm going to put this again. Oh, you just saw it. Don't pause that. Don't pause that. Putting it face down. Okay. We got a crushing hammer. Shelter. Okay. I'm not really expecting there to be anything in these. I'm expecting it all to be in those sleeves. Dude, I don't know how Pokemon, like, YouTubers talk their entire video. Well, they also know, like, all the new ones, and I really just, I honestly could care less. Okay, hello. Is that Champion's Path? Oh, wait, maybe it is. Is that the Champion's Path from chat? I haven't been able to open any Champion's Path. Okay, more reverse. Electric energy. Another reverse. A hollow gas lead to go with. <laughs> I mean, did this guy know that I was buying all of the freaking Gengars? What a guy. Okay. Okay. This is going to be fun. Ultra Ball. Okay, okay. I would say definitely this one. I mean, even right off the rip is going to be one of the better ones. I still have some coming, by the way. We got code cards. Go get them. We got another one. Go get them. And then a fire and a Pikachu. Now let's see what this guy gave us. First card, we got them all right here, right? We're just gonna go like this. What the heck is this? Uh, it evolves from Flapple, which I think is the worst Pokemon in the history of Pokemon. Wow, a shiny Elcremie. Okay, okay. Uh, in DDV. Okay, and then. What is this? Don't know why this one just sleeps. Okay. Anyway. See, I don't know. Because, like, as far as, like, overall shine, this guy hooked it up. I mean, these are all reverse hollows, hollows, and the one um, full art. I really don't give a sh kid show. I really don't give a... Uh, Poop about Ndidi though. I'll, and then the other, I mean, I would just say this was a, su a successful uh, mystery box opening. Got a rainbow rare, got full art, 
got some vintage, got a vintage Charizard, which, by the way, is totally clickbait. Yeah, I'm totally, I am totally using it in the tag. So, if you click this, because you read that I pulled a vintage Charizard, I'm so sorry, but I need the views. Again, I'm sorry. Smash the thumbs up. Please don't hate me. Peace.